G. G minor. <laughs> Yeah, man. Like you can check. I'm ready to growl. We've heard two songs from EXO before, Mama and Overdose. So this is Growl. This came out right after Mama, but before Overdose. I don't think anything's ever gonna beat the high expectations set by Mama. It's yeah, that was something. That was something. Five, four, three, two. <laughs> okay, I'm already, yep, yep, good start. Yeah. <laughs> Funky. Cool. What a nice synth sound. This is like really synthesized electric bass, right? Guitar synth, like, it sounds really cool. But they cut off the decay. Uh, it's definitely a tritone sub for two, which is hashtag jazz. Strong beat. This is like what I want to hear at a party. Yeah. This is a grinding song. Two. But that false little harmonization. Four. Oh, 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 oh. What was that? <laughs> Gotta go through some major modes. Holy shit. Oh, this bridge is dope. This Whoa. Is good. And then we're back. Man, it's like magic. Wow, I like this a lot. It's like a little little sneaky little dude walking around. It's like a sneaky little dude. <laughs> it's like till. Yeah. Ooh, that was a good chord. Oh my god. Okay, so one vocal part on each note of the seventh chord. That was pretty sweet. No, that's classy. Take the sleeves Ooh. off completely. Mm. Ooh, that pink haired guy is looking at me with, with, with intent. This is so hot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you get quality productions, man. Man, the dancing. Yeah, look at that guy. I like that Austin. Go to the bridge pattern. again. Bring the bass forward. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, oh yes. This song is so good. <laughs> so silky. Is this also rated NC-17? Because it should be. I'm definitely into this under layer of like... Oh, that high note. Ooh, nice high vocals. Rose. They really? Oh yeah, there's someone up there. Please uh, have Sistrum. it happen one Sistrum. more time. Sistrum. For people who like this song. It's gone now. There's some tambourine there. Check out Hiatus Coyote. Ooh, those cluster chords are really good. Yeah. Come on, come on, you can do it again. Here we go. Ooh. Oh, here's the rapper. That was so good. So the chords have dropped out. The electric bass has dropped out, but we still hear it in the key. It's like such empty orchestration here. It's just like beats, voice. There it is. A little bit. They're wow. really together. <laughs> Damn. If only our section playing was this good. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, I love that harmonization. Here it comes again. Aww. Sparkles. Jazz man. Kendrick Lamar, baby. Ooh, yeah. Oh, they all have beautiful eyes. Oh, no. I like it. I aspire to be like the quarter as hot as these guys. Yeah, there's, wow. Yeah, this is, there's something about this that I just really enjoy. Yeah, this is the EXO I remember. You know, the, the great dancing. Ooh, there was a good run in there, too. Oh, I love that. Every time. Those chords! Good melody is going. Wow, I keep forgetting how easy it is to harmonize when there are 12 people. I know, right? <laughs> that ostinato is still going. Yeah, I mean, that's how an ostinato works, but it doesn't always last the whole song. But that's really awesome. Half step modulation. No, 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 no. no. Modulations. Well, ooh, into the hat, here we go. Ooh, that was fucking that high. That was hot! Shit. Wow, wait, holy that was shit. Cool. I, I like this. It. I was filming like one or two continuous takes. With like a lot of editing, but like like good. very fluid camera movement. That was great. I like the instrumentals a lot. Yeah, I liked that ostinato. Yeah. I also liked like that the Rhodes synth sound. There was always like this little stuff like going on underneath, and so I was always just like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it would just come in and out. It was very, very good. Yeah, honestly, that was that was really entertaining. I liked that a lot. I also liked the song. I like that bum 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 da 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 da. da how it was just like throughout the song, and that kind of goes back to like how. Popular songs have popular motifs that repeat all the time. Motifs. That's why you like them. Motifs. Motifs. So, what did you think about it? You drink soup, you don't eat it. <laughs> but, uh, no, I really enjoyed it. It was really cool. I, I thought everything really came to, together and it was just like, it was a good music video. Yeah, the continuous shot thing was really interesting because, like, it was almost like you, you never, like, stop seeing all of them. 
mm -hmm. even though like as one disappeared it came into the other side of the thing which i mean sure it took some amazing editing and whatnot the back beat was really dope they just kind of had the like little thing in the back like just going the whole time yeah which makes for a very effective pop song ready this is or chromatic passing chords. No, no, this no? is pretty out there. This Seriously? is like really out there. When I heard it, I was like, what? Here so, we go. So we go. This is I never caught how far it goes. Like, what's the next chord when they go major? No, they didn't. The first two times they didn't go back though. They, this they, is a flat seven. It's it's a flat, a flat seven three. In there. It's like a my. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> a cannon. <laughs> So Maybe call me a baby. <laughs> no. Now we're moving on to Call Me Baby, which came out a few years after Growl and after Overdose. This one is very similar in style to Growl. It's also continuing so hip hoppy vibe. Yes, stack those thirds, baby. Keep it coming. Oh. No. no. Oh wow. I also want to talk about their music too, because we didn't actually get a chance to talk about their actual music. <laughs> Look at those cars. That's a sick car. It's a pretty color. What is up with K-pop people and lollipops? Fair point. Ah, uh, dude, don't sit on your Ferrari like that. That'll fuck it up. Oh, well, and how fat do you think he is? Nice wood block. Eyebrows on fleek. Whoa. That Bluetooth touch sensitive uh, headset. It's like, oh, some future shit. Oh, I like this. Oh, this would be great for a bass dictation. I'm getting a grease vibe here. Oh. Like, oh my God. they're all yes. in the car. They look so cool. Well, that was cool though. They look really cute in this. Do you hear all that? In the background. Yes. This is actually a work of impressionist. Sing me as a previous song. This is actually an impressionist piece. Really? Because of all those tiny fists. <laughs> you hear that in the harmony? I like how they do, they match the dancing to the beat when it like mm -hmm. thump, thump, thump. Yeah. Nice. Where BTS, whoa, dancing though, my god, is a bunch of individuals who work really well as a group. Major! Wow. Oh, they stay in major! I feel the EXO, nicely done, is as a group, a single unit, a very good single unit. Wow, I There's wish. Some, I don't know if it's synth brass or real brass, but it's brass. Bam, bam. It's a good brass. Dude, I wish I had that much confidence to just. Go directly from parallel major to minor like that. Well, I'm talking with my mouth, though, chewing with talking. <laughs> Stop doing that. Yeah, I don't think I really like that background, like synthesized trumpet string. Oh god, I'll settle my. My. my <laughs> I can't follow up. Oh! oh. Those jeans would look real awesome with like some fishnets underneath. Oh, what the? The dancing is so good. I like the dancing better than the song. That was our best moment since Tchaikovsky. Just both of us. <laughs> I'm going on a date with my pillow tonight. Breakdown. Oh man, the dance moves match the little beat. See, oh. this is example of a trope done very well. They cut out it's Right, right, out. right. That's true. Did you hear that high line? Like, if they have a keychain in this song, I won't be mad. I'd be like, yes. <laughs> uh, that, that, I got a Michael Jackson feel there. These guys are a killer. They're still. Whoa, that was weird. Oh. There's some good. There's a lot of variety in this song. And I like it when a song has variety like this. That one interlude, they like 
held on to the seven for so long, but then they didn't give us a solid tonic. Like, didn't have a, you know? Oh shit, I'm loving the blue velvet jumpsuit that, I got, yeah. that guy's wearing. Yeah, that's all velvet. Oh, that false little game is too strong. Oh god, oh. Okay. They're very good at hip thrusts. <laughs> Austin Powers moment. The wardrobe in these videos is awesome. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay. Oh. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah, I'll call you. <laughs> yeah, this is better than Carly Rae Jepsen. Oh. Jepsen. <laughs> And I like that song too. That was cool. Yeah. I'm, I'm really liking this group. Come here, baby. Come here, baby. The vibe just like totally reversed from the beginning to the end. Yeah. Which is good because I didn't we went like from the, inside the, of the feel garage. at the beginning. I didn't like the feel at the beginning yeah. and I liked it. I mean, in terms of the video, I liked the song uh, from the beginning, but like, mm -hmm. yeah. These guys kick butt. Like the choreographer did a real good job. Probably some of the best dancing I've seen K pop right here. Yeah. For sure. I mean, just they were really tight. Look, just they obviously spent a lot of time going through the motions. And I mean, I feel like from a musical standpoint, and, you know, there's a lot of like, you know, electronic background and stuff. Like there weren't a lot of like natural sounds in it. Mm -hmm. And uh, which is like totally appropriate for this kind of music. So yeah, I think they were they were really going from the like, we're a pop sensation. <clears throat> <laughs> yeah, I definitely agree. Cause now that I listen to this one, and after hearing like the like the, uh, hearing growl, like now I kind of see like they they basically like you said they have like that beat going throughout. You know, a lot of not really natural sounds, and like it gets kind of repetitive after a while, which is totally fine because like you're just totally into the dancing. So that's the cool thing about this group is they're very dance oriented. And, like compared to like the last song that we just watched, I feel like there was a lot more visuals in this one. You know, hopping to the different scenes, the different whatever. Whereas last one was just all in that one room. Which I like both, and I, I I loved the cars in the beginning. Yes, those yes. those were sharp. I definitely thought that this was a cool video, and like I said, I like the effect that EXO has of like their choreography of having so many people that they have the ability to sort of be everywhere at once. Yeah, it's really well done. Uh -huh. Also, did not like this music at all. Oh, you didn't? No. Okay. Hmm. It's a bam, 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 bam. Come on! Really I don't like dance. This. I know you can. Hey, not a chance. No. That's what it reminded me of. Uh -huh. The whole time I figured it out. But like, wait, we have to talk about the music. Do As a group, fuck me up. Okay, wait, I'm gonna say that without a swear word. As a group, they're really, really good. Cause it's like, the harmonies are very complex. A lot of times they're like cluster, like true cluster chords. And it's so cool. Especially in growl, holy f I think that this was a really good, this is a good example of overproduction. Like Ooh. this is a good example of what it means like to have a heavily produced song. Cause it is, it's heavily produced in a good way. Like, mm -hmm. it fits with their sound naturally. Because, like, you can tell all of the sound mixing was done in the studio. You can tell all of the background was done in the studio. And that works. But it was done to match their style. Yeah. They weren't trying to make something that wasn't already their style. And their cluster chords fuck me up. Yeah. Um, as it pertains to this video, man, as I said, they're just a solid group. Yeah. They're a solid group that's representing their hip-hop really genre mean. really well. And I'm getting more of a hip, like, you're, it's definitely more hip-hop. Mm -hmm. um, where BTS Like you is, said, where K-pop is, like, actually all of the genres, yep, this is hip-hop. Yeah, and, like, where BTS is maybe, like, a little, they go a little deeper into their songs. This is definitely, I don't even want to say more upbeat, just more it's like... Just like it, yeah, exactly. It's hip hop. It's just more hip hop, yeah. and it's it's good. They do it well. They do it really right. well. That's on call me, baby. Hell yeah. I will okay, definitely call them. Hell yeah. Let's spit rice on your hand. <laughs> yeah. Yes. You know, I just want that. I want the sudden, the, the jarring. But would the, the jar. not musicians want that? Yes. <laughs> Remember that one part that I kept saying, like nice harmonization. Oh, yeah, every yeah. voice, like one vocal line on the same yes. note. That's like. No, 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 no. no. That's not. That's not those two. Prove this. Oh, you're right. Yes. Cool. You did it. You did it. 